to Lake Champlain now and an update on a brave group known as the Red Hot Chili Dippers. We told you a few weeks ago how they're wading into the icy water every day this month, sometimes more than once a day to raise money for a charity serving at risk youth. More of this crazy video from their latest outing in a bit. But first, Jack Thurston tells us about the good work all those frigid dips are supporting. It was a really dark time in my life. Tian Berry of Burlington, Vermont. I didn't believe in myself. Insists she is who she is today because of Spectrum Youth and Family Services. I was having a lot of challenges with my mental health. Um, and Spectrum really helped me access the services that I needed. Several years ago, Tian didn't always know where she was going to spend the night. After a family crisis meant her home was sold and she was left couch surfing. Then the nonprofit offered her critical transitional housing and meals, the first steps on a positive path. It's not that I needed someone to do the work for me to get to where I am, it's that I need someone to believe that I could get to where I am. Now, Spectrum is expanding. The need is definitely there in this community. This week, opening a brand new daytime drop-in center a half hour or so north of Burlington in St. Albans. It'll be a safe place for support groups to work on a resume or where staff can connect young people to mental health resources or other services in the area. For those that are homeless or have unstable housing, if they're wandering around, they have no place that they can just come and sit and be warm. So we want to provide that for them or have a warm shower, do their laundry, have a hot meal. And the red hot chili dippers are supporting that mission. This is definitely worth getting wet for. The group of friends using their daily dips into Lake Champlain to collect pledges for Spectrum. Already they've smashed their $10,000 goal and aren't slowing down. Spectrum's executive director even joining the dippers in the 34 degree water to say thank you, adding the new St. Albans facility and other offerings wouldn't be possible without this kind of passionate care from the community. I do believe the work we do saves lives. I know it saves lives. I know it does. I wouldn't have gone to college. Tian Berry's now working toward her bachelor's degree and has a job in human services. She's raising thousands for Spectrum right along with the chili dippers. Fantastic. Glad to get cold for the organization that kept her warm when she needed it most. I'd rather dip in a hot tub, but you know, this is fun too. In Burlington, Jack Thurston, NBC5 News.